Hello guys, today is Wednesday and yesterday my family and I, we went to the store but I totally forgot my camera. So let me show you guys what we bought. Well, my husband needed some tennis shoes because the, one, the ones he has are a little bit old already. So I bought him some shoes. These are the ones that he ended up getting. These are actually his favorite. He has had these before and he just went with those just to be on the safe side and because this store always has a buy one get one half off I got me I got me these ones which are Pumas and they are pink and they are leather and I love them really really happy with our purchase right there and we ended up going to Walmart as well and I found these shirts was pleasantly surprised to find these shirts because I've been looking for just plain no sayings no nothing on them t-shirts and I found me a black one and a lavender one this one is super pretty color and they were only $3.88 as you guys can see right there and I ended up buying me this uh, hair dye soft black because my hair is uh, like a light to dark brown and my hair extensions are black completely black so sometimes my hair extensions don't match my hair whenever I wear them and it is the time to re-dye my hair already because it's turning brown again so yeah those were our buys from yesterday I'm super happy today I might be going to Macy's to return a dress let me show you guys So I don't know if you guys follow me on Snapchat or Instagram or whatever, but if you do, you probably know that um, a week ago on the 27th, June 27th, we were in Texas for a wedding and I ended up wearing this beautiful gown right here. It is super pretty, has embroidery, um, flowers and everything. I'll insert a picture of how it looked on me. But we had lots and lots of fun. This one was my son's blazer. He was all um, dressed for the occasion and everything because it was my cousin's wedding. But I also ended up buying this beautiful dress. Let me get it out of the bag so you guys can see. So this is the dress it is actually super beautiful and that's why I bought it because I was undecided undecisive as of to wear this one or this one over here but I ended up wearing this one the main reason is because this one is beautiful and everything and this one was actually the length that I needed but in the back show you guys this is all see-through all see-through right here is beautiful and it has like a corset going through right there but this is the main reason why I didn't wear this one this one is a strapless right here and I actually have very chunky arms so I did not like that and then the corset you had to really pull it to make it very cinched you know because I ended up buying a size 5 and it was let me show you guys right here it was $152 it was already 40% off but you have to really cinch it right here and I bought a size 5 like I was telling you because that was the last size that I found that would fit me all the other ones were size 11 and stuff like that 
so they wouldn't fit me at all but this one let me show you guys how beautiful this dress is i wish i could keep it but there is no point in me keeping something that see it goes like this and then when i did this to my back you could see like a little fat going through here you know because it was so tight so that it could keep the bustier um from falling from my boobs so this had to be really tight and i have kind of a little bit of a fat <laughs> a fatter over here like torso i don't know this part right here is pretty fat so it ended up doing like one of those butts i don't know if you guys understand what i'm saying but like my fat gathered here and i did not like that at all this is a beautiful dress but it did not serve its purpose let me show you guys the dress that i ended up wearing <clears throat> So it was just this beautiful dress right here. I ended up loving it. It has this beautiful rhinestones as the little cinched waist. And it's pretty simple. Up on top is just spaghetti strap. And it covered my tatas really well. Which nothing was showing. And then the back, it was pretty simple. No corset, no nothing. So it fit perfectly. And I ended up wearing this one. Also, a second reason why I didn't wear the pink one was because my daughter wore a pink one and I didn't want to be twinsy twinsy, you know, like walking there and both of us wearing pink. This one was my daughter's. Oh my goodness, she looked beautiful in this dress. I'll insert pictures of how we ended up looking as a family. My husband just wore some cowboy boots and a cowboy hat just like he likes to wear he was pretty comfortable but if you guys would like me to if you guys would like me to uh, upload the wedding that we ended up going to it was beautiful there was a lot less people than expected because of covid but overall the wedding was still super beautiful if you guys would like to see um, the wedding and everything, leave it in the comments below and I will upload it. If I don't hear anything, then I haven't uploaded it because I don't know, I, that's kind of personal and I don't know if that is something you guys would like to see. But if you guys do would like to see it, uh, let me know and I will upload it. I didn't uh, do like us packing for the trip and going in there and everything i just didn't have time because my parents decided we were for sure that we were not gonna go to this wedding it was on the 27th and then on the 24th or 23rd my parents decided let's go to the wedding you know and it was in texas so it was pretty much uh, seven to eight hours away it wasn't that far but i only had two to three days because we left that friday friday the 26th i believe we left friday after my husband's job after work and yeah we ended up being there saturday in the morning no actually friday like at 2 in the morning, I think we were there. Something like that. But the reason why I did not film us packing and buying stuff and stuff was because I only had 2 to 3 days to do this. It was a quick, quick um, wedding <laughs> for us. I mean, we had planned it. We knew she was getting married and everything. But because my dad had COVID, 
um, we ended up postponing it and saying, you know what, I'm sorry, but we can't go. And, but my dad recuperated perfectly. He is just um, with oxygen right now, but he is doing great. And he was uh, tested negative for the COVID. So we decided to go because this was my mom's um, my mom's sister's daughter that was getting married so they are very very close to us so we ended up finally getting our stuff together and going it was a very fast like decision making so yeah i only had two to three days to come up with the outfits and this is what came up i was actually really proud i had my daughter's dress because this wedding has been planned since april but because of covid april got canceled and postponed until june 27th and this is why we ended up going in june so yeah if you guys would like to see uh the wedding like i just told you guys let me know in the comments and i would gladly upload it for you guys i will for sure um put different music not the one that we had in, at the wedding because that is copyrighted music and unfortunately so yeah right now i'm just cleaning my house and i'll see you guys a little bit later whenever i feel what if i end up going to return the macy's dress i'll bring you guys along with me uh the reason that i want to return is because i don't like how it fit me in the back especially it's a beautiful dress don't get me wrong but $150 just to keep in the closet. I can use it for something else, for decorations or anything like that. Right now I'm lacking some pillows in my bedroom. Let me show you guys. So as you guys can see, I upgraded my bedding and I really love it. Is this pink with flowers, roses and stuff? But look at this. <laughs> I still have my old um what is this called bed sheets and they don't go with this at all and this is what i use see my pillow is super small it's from walmart it's not even a king for this king bed so that's why i don't have the sham that goes in the pillow then this one is my husband's and you guys can see the pattern the checker pattern underneath <laughs> because I don't know I'm just weird like that I put this underneath and then I put this one on top and it doesn't really look you it kind of looks worn out or old so my goal is to buy new pillows so that I can use the the correct pillow shams and also new bedding because that not bedding but sheets because those don't go anymore with this so yeah that is what i have been up to if i end up going to ross i'll bring you guys along with me but other than that i'll see you guys a little bit later